this is the first time I've read a book over 400 pages. This is 136 pages over 400 pages. Someone please pray for me. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is another reading vlog. Um, though this one's going to be a lot more exciting because I'm reading Crooked Kingdom. Yep, I'm very, I'm very excited for this. I'm not excited for chapter 40 because apparently everybody that I see talk about this book has always said that chapter 40 rips their heart out of their chest. So I'm not excited for that in like just it's it's not I'm not very excited for that but that's not towards the end of the book so I have some time to you know just get there be prepared for that type deal um this is the second book in the six of crows duology which also means it's the last book which I'm very disappointed about because I love the storyline, I love the characters, mainly Kaz, which I talked about in my monthly wrap up. Um, I just, I, I love everything about this duology and I'm not excited for it to end. This is also my first time reading a duology, so we'll see if I prefer them over trilogies or not, because trilogies I love trilogies. I used to love series, but they got too long for me, so. So I just realized that I've been tabbing my books with what I thought was black, but it's actually a very dark green. And I've used this, the tabs, the black tab so much that I have two left because I thought that it was black, but it's just a very dark green in good lighting. This one. This is not happening. Okay. It is a little while later. I, it's been like two hours. Um, I am on page 50, 536. Um, I'm almost done with part one. I have like, I have 15 pages left in part one and then I will be done with this, this part of the book. There's six parts in these books. That's how I like format it. Um, it's very good. There's already one thing that has happened. It's a very like minor thing but I did not expect it to happen so I book tabbed it did I book tab it no I book tabbed a different part but um I'll probably end up book tabbing that too but yeah I, I honestly can't believe that Jesper actually did that that's probably like the one thing that I didn't think he would ever do so that was quite unbelievable um so yes, I'm I'm very much enjoying this book. So it's 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 on its way to be another five star. Um, I'm not gonna say right now 100%. It's definitely a five star because things could change. But it's definitely on its way there, and I've only read 50 pages. So yeah, this is gonna be a really good book. Um, I think I'm gonna do well. I'm gonna do a lot more reading today. Um, I'm hoping to get through the f second part too. Um, by the end of the day, that would be like really good. Um, cause this is a very book, good, a very big book. So I need to make steady progress throughout these next couple of days. Otherwise I'm never going to finish this book because it's quite large and I wasn't expecting, I was I knew it was going to be like a thicker one than Six of Crows, but I wasn't expecting it to be 500 and something pages long, so. Okay, it is 
the next day. I did get quite a bit of reading done since the last time I've updated you. I am on part three, page 147. Um, it's very good so far. And I'm really, I'm really enjoying this. So, um, I am about to go to Barnes. So I'm going to film a little bit, but not a lot. Because I don't really want to film in front of a bunch of people. So we'll see if I even film anything at all. But I will give you a book haul later. Okay, I am back from the bookstore. I didn't film anything because when I was walking in, there was like this little old lady walking in with me. So I got too nervous, so I didn't film anything while I was in the store. But I will show you what I got. First we have Unite Me, which has Destroy Me and Fracture Me in it. It's like two little novellas in the Shatter Me series. It's book 1.5 and then book 2.5. So this was on my TBR and now I have it so I can read it. So that's the first book that I got. And then I got The Summer I Turned Pretty, which is the first book in the, the Summer I Turned Pretty trilogy. Um, this was also on my TBR. It's very small. Like it's smaller than I expected it to be. It's, ve it's very small. It's way smaller than I thought it was going to be. But this will be a cute little summer read and it will get me just in the mood for summer so those are the two books that i got i only i didn't get very far in crooked kingdom while i was there i read for a little bit which you guys did not see because i got too nervous to film because there was people every place that i went in barnes and noble so i didn't film anything because i got like scared um but i did get a little bit further in crooked kingdom so that's good. Um, I have no idea where it's at right now. I would tell you what page I'm at, but I don't know where it is. Um, but I will find it. So yeah, that is, that's my update for right now. Okay, I am at the 200 page mark. I'm about, mm, I'm about halfway through part three. It's very good. I just got to a twist. It's a very good twist. I was not expect- yeah, I wasn't expecting it. Um, and the twist that I just got connects the Shadow and Bone trilogy to now this duology. So that makes- like, that makes this like a whole other thing. Like, this is- that's- that's really cool. And it makes me very happy because- this just adds like a whole other dimension to this duology. You know, like obviously it's all part of the same world, but now they're like truly connecting, which just, I love it. I love it. That's, that's all I had to update you on. That's, I just, I wanted to tell you that I'm absolutely amazed at this little like surprise that has just been thrown in here. So it's, it's going to add so much to the story and I'm so excited for that. So I had to update you guys. Okay, it is the next day. Um, I finished part three and I'm very mad because I just, it's a spoiler if I tell you why I'm mad, but let's just say if Van Eck doesn't get everything that he deserves. I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna be so mad. I'm gonna be so mad. I'm gonna be so mad, okay? Because I just... He really better get everything that he deserves or I'm gonna lose it. I'm really just gonna lose it. Also, I think I figured out who dies and how they die. So I really gotta keep it together because that's gonna make me very sad so um i'm on part four i did not read two parts yesterday like i planned on reading but that that's that's okay 
that is okay. We will just read to three parts today. No, we were not reading three parts today. That's half of the book. So that's not half. Um, I'm so not looking forward to this. Because I don't know. We're in the last half of the book. So at any time, the person that I think is going to die could die. Or I could be completely wrong and somebody else could die. And I think that would, depending on who it would be, it would make it a lot worse. They're like, it's, it's, it's gonna be hard no matter who it is, but it'll, there's like three certain characters that'll make it even harder to deal with. So I'm praying it won't be those three. I'm praying it won't be those three because I do not want to go through that. I think I was wrong about who dies. Here's my little update. I'm on page 298. The ending of chapter 20. We've switched POVs, so I can't really know what happens next, which scares me. Because, um, one of One of the three people that I said if they died, it would be like a thousand times worse. They're in a deadly situation right now. So, I'm, I, I'm not okay currently. I'm scared. I'm very scared. Let, let's just say, since the last time that I updated you guys, things from couple people's past has returned and if what happens in the past happens all over again you know in like present time I I will actually lose it like I will actually actually lose it and I'm not happy about what just happened. I'm really not happy. Okay, that's all I had to say. I'm not happy, so someone please pray for me. Okay, I just finished Ow, um, part four. It's the smallest part but it's the most, well, I'm not gonna say it's the most action packed because I still have part five and part six and the way that part four ends, I'm ready. I am ready. This is backwards. I'm ready. I'm, I'm so ready for what's about to happen because we're switching things up a little bit, you know? Well, the characters are. Um, I just know things are about to get so good, like so good, and I'm very excited. And I don't know if you guys can see, but I have tabbed a lot. Not a lot. More than I usually do, I've tabbed. So... I, I would say this book is five stars and I still have 200 pages left. I have 200 pages left in this book and I'm, it's five star. Like I, I, I can't ignore the fact that this is 100% going to be a five star read unless something happens. I don't know. It would have to be something where I'm like, it wouldn't be, it would be like something 
like an unnecessarily bad thing happening or something like that something that doesn't fit into the storyline and how this duology needs to end it would have to be something like so just randomly thrown in there and not even like worked into the storyline well so this will this this will be a five star read i'm like not a shadow of a doubt in my mind that this is going to be a five star read so I'm, I'm very excited for the next two parts because this is about to get really good and it's been really good since i started it so this is i'm i'm just so excited i'm so excited for this this is getting so so good it's so good so good okay i finished part five did i update you guys after i finished part four yeah yeah okay so i finished part five and it's <laughs> this book is so good like I, I i don't even i keep using the same words every time i update you guys that i like i'm just getting repetitive at this point um i'm very mad at wylan or however you pronounce his name i think it's wylan i'm very mad at him right now so there's that and I don't know I mean Kaz's plan is pretty like it's it's gonna take a lot for this to actually go well especially with how part five ended like it's going to take a miracle a miracle for this to end up the way that they want it to and there's about a hundred pages left in the book nobody's died yet so that's gonna happen in this part and i'm not i'm not excited about it whatsoever i'm actually quite scared we've come close to people dying several times so i am terrified but that's all i have to update you guys on right now okay so it is the next day um i didn't read it all since the last time i updated you guys but i have a little over 100 pages to go so we're gonna finish this book today and then i will give you a completed review of what i think about this book and i'm very sad because somebody's gonna die and that's probably gonna make me cry so I'm not excited for that. I also think I realized something about the plan. You kind of have to think outside the box when you're thinking about the plans that Kaz comes up with, but I, I, so I'm not, I don't think I'm mad at Wylan, Wylan anymore. I don't think I'm mad at him anymore because I think I figured out everything that I needed. I think, I think I, I think I figured out why this is, what he did is in fact a good thing and not a bad thing. So everything's going great I think kind of not really a little bit it's 50 50 so I'm scared okay <laughs> something amazing just happened oh my gosh 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 this this is this is amazing this is amazing i can't believe this is happening right now i can't believe this is happening right now can we just can we just a round of applause for Wyland Van Eck, please. Just like <laughs> Yes. Yes. Okay, he is just yes. Just yes to everything. Oh my goodness, this is amazing. This just keeps getting better and better. 
better and better and better and better and better. I'm loving this. Kaz's mind is brilliant. Brilliant. And this is amazing. Oh my goodness. This is... Oh my goodness. This is like... I have no words to describe what I'm feeling right now other than yes and this is amazing that's that's like I can't even tell you why this is so amazing because it it's a spoiler like I it I just know that parts if you haven't read this book yet part six 10 out of 10, 11 out of 10, 5,000 out of 10, okay? Just, I'm, wow, wow, absolutely fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. I, again, Kaz's mind, brilliant. Waylon, Waylon Van Eck, chef's kiss, buddy, like, you could not have put up a better performance than you did right now. I can't. I honestly cannot believe that he did that. Okay, that was scary. Um, an interesting way to end the chapter as well. I'm on chapter 35, by the way. Or I just finished chapter 35, which was INJ point of view. I'm not entirely sure how you pronounce your name, but I think that is INJ. I'm not entirely sure. Don't quote me on that. Um, so I'm on page 464. Things are getting good. And the last sentence of chapter 35, I want to know what it means. We shall find out, I suppose. I mean, I... If it... Based on what happened in the Shadow and Bone trilogy, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say the exact same thing. It's the same thing that's gonna happen in this duology to one of the characters. Um, at least I'm hoping. I'm hoping that what the last sentences in chapter 35 isn't literal. Because that, this whole book would be pointless if it was, and that would not make it five star. I might, I don't know how low of a rating, like a rating it would be, but it would be pretty low if that last sentence was literal. I will actually lose it. I'd like, I, I will actually lose it, like actually, actually lose it. Okay, I have finished Crooked Kingdom. It was very good. I'm giving it five stars. Um, the ending was both sad and, like, amazing. And the, the plan that Kaz came up with, it was so good. And see, what was interesting is that 95% of that plan was a lie and everyone believed it everyone which was absolutely amazing um i mean i i believed it until i was told the reality of what was really going on um and i, I mean i was i was just absolutely blown away by this book it's so it's so incredibly good like please read this duology if you haven't i'm begging you because like six of crows was very very good but crooked kingdom is like unmatched like i've never read a book this good before and if you watched my monthly wrap up you know that six of crows was just absolutely an unbelievable book to me and th this has trumped that which is really good because, you know, obviously when you're reading like a book that good and it's in a series, you want the series to be, you know, just as good. And 
I mean, it like Crooked Kingdom was a thousand times better than Six of Crows, which I I had high hopes for this book and they absolutely blew that out of the water. I mean, this book was a thousand times better than I thought it was going to be. And all of the things that went wrong, I was like, I was so mad about it towards like the middle and the beginning. I was so mad about all the things that kept going wrong. And then you get to part five and six and you're like, this was all meant to happen. Like this, this, everything happened the exact way that it was supposed to happen. And just everything about this book is amazing. And these books are written in third person and I typically don't like third person like it's hard for me to get through the book but I, I completely looked over that and it was not like an issue whatsoever reading this duology and typically typically I like it just it bugs me and it kind of like affects the the rating that I give the book because it just like affects me so much for some reason I don't know what it is about third person POV but I just I don't like it but with this with this duology like I I didn't care I I really 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 didn't care like whatsoever it didn't like bug me at all like I had no issues with it and I barely even realized that I was reading third person which is which is odd but like I, I barely barely realized that I was reading third person so this book was absolutely amazing and I highly recommend this book to absolutely everyone on the face of the planet except for you know like younger kids but everybody else like 15 and up please read this book please all right that is the end of this video I hope you guys enjoyed because I absolutely loved this video so I hope you guys did too um make sure to subscribe like this video and hit the notification bell if you want to be notified every time that I love upload which is on Mondays and I will see you guys in the next video bye